Hello guys and welcome to Yarelina's River Nursery. Here I am with three treasures, my three full body silicone babies. So um, today I'm going to bring them to downstairs to the nursery and we're going to chat for a little bit with you guys and change these little ones because here in my bedroom I don't have a lot of things and I was sick so I was not interacting with them and I was not dressing them and I can, you know, go up um, downstairs because it was raining a lot. And uh, yeah, so today I'm going to do something fun with them. So please keep watching. Well guys, before I share um, my changing on my silicones, I want to share with you something I did before I was a collector and that I decide um, in the moving to bring him to my collection uh, or my working room or whatever you want to call it, but he's going to stay here. And he's, um, I don't know if you're familiarized with Build a Bear. So he is Peter Rabbit from Build a Bear. And this is what I have, the, even the hanging uh, thing and two outfits that he has. So this was very close to what I was um, ignored. This, this is the baby that I'm brooding. So I have him covered because I'm not um, working on him, of course. I was sick, so I was not in here. So I need to cover everything. Um, but the thing is, guys, that um, even when I was not a collector, this was very close to what is collecting and buying things specifically to the size and, you know, complexion of um, the babies. But um, I need to bring my, my kid because I, the last thing I knew, I knew about Build-A-Bear is that they are not in Puerto Rico anymore. But I need to check on that because someone told me that they still they are here. So... Um, I know my kid is going to go crazy, my smaller one. Before I was there with my um, oldest and he loved it. Um, and this is a gift from my husband. So he's Peter Rabbit. So before collecting, I knew I loved Peter Rabbit. <laughs> so this is some outfits. And he was um, from March 8th of 19, um, 2018. So he has his years and he has heartbeat and all that, but none of that is working now. So he's going to stay here um, in my, in my, you know, my nursery. So you're going to see him here and there. Well, guys, excuse the angle and all that. I'm trying to figure out what works um, because it's a new place. Um, it's a new setting. I'm going to powder her, powder him very lightly because um, I have noticed that when it's not um, hot weather, they are very, very well, you know, I don't have to powder them and all that. But um, I just want to slightly do it because I haven't do it any in um, a while. And just because I see some tiny hairs and things that are sticking around him, not a big deal, but yeah, I prefer to see him, you know, as he was before. And just matting him a little bit. But, um,. I can see his, his, his neck a little bit white because I put a lot of matting powder there. But, but yeah, I was feeling sick. Um, I was not feeling well. I was not working at all. And I'm still struggling with that. I'm still not feeling well. I feel dizzy all the time. But hopefully... This is going to pass and um, I think it was a virus or something. So we're going to dress him and because I want to dress and powder also Jaden and Journey, um, I'm going to record today, but um, I'm 
going to make separate videos for them. So this sweet guy is Kellen. Um, I named him Kella, Kellen Jael. I really love this tiny little squish. You know, my favorite size on Reborns and also on silicones, I figured that is zero to three. It's easy to dress and all that. But I found this guy so realistic in his movements. And because he's so soft, he just, he melts into your arms. He's just exquisite. He's still bald, as you can see. I haven't had a minute to root him. Um, I'm currently, actually today, I am going to keep rooting a baby that I have in my table um, that I have not finished. I have a couple of people asking for rooting services, but I really can't right now because i'm super super full of many things that i have to finish and i haven't so when i finish the baby i'm brooding um i need to figure if i'm going to paint and root one of my babies or if i'm going to root my laura and sell her because as you can notice i have not sell any babies for a while and i really need to you know to make some profits so that's that but i really miss you guys i really miss making videos i really love to be here on youtube and even though i'm not feeling 100 percent good i'm feeling um good enough to make a video and i love this because it's so newborn -y. and if you hear something in the background is my son He's here with me downstairs. Um, the older one is upstairs doing his own homework um, separate from him because they, they can be distracted each other. <laughs> but um, I have now in the new house, this is a little bit on him. And Jaden is so tight. And on him is so big. I don't know if how I feel about it. Mm. Anyways, um, in this new house, I have a space that is going to be dedicated to to my nursery, and I'm going to have a space dedicated to what is going to be the homeschool area for them to have their own space to. To study and have their you know things to do there separate from the house and separate from the nursery which is great and it was something that I was oh my gosh waiting for for a long time and I never thought <laughs> I could have this opportunity um, I'm sorry he's so soft let me put him in a different angle so um, it's so nice that I'm going to have this space for the dolls. I'm still figure, figuring out how I'm going to, to do it, how to place things. Um, I'm still moving. I have a lot of things in my tiny house. And even though I have space now, I am trying to figure out how, how to, you know, to place things to maximize the space and all that. So has been a a big movement, a big a big change. And I'm sorry I feel a little bit um like my breath is oh, I feel short of breath, but but I'm doing better, guys. Um so I'm very excited to have this new space, but again, it's a lot, it's a lot to do still. Plus I need to work and brood babies and sell because I need to. <laughs> so what do you think guys? He's very sweet, but it's big on him. So I don't know if I'm going to keep that. 
I don't know if I'm going to do some shorts or not shorts, but pants. Um, I really don't know. I thought it would fit him better because Angelian was a little bit tight. Uh, let me check. Okay, I don't have anything that I really want to put on him. So I'm going to let him to be like this. Um, uh, he actually looks cute. <laughs> And the intent was just powder him and give him some attention here on YouTube, even though privately I'm doing it. Um, so, guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, lately, I was um, tempted to go and buy something, but I was not feeling good. I just was doing the groceries. I came back running because I just felt so bad because of the dizziness that I have all the time. But anyways, um, I need to buy something for him and for Jaden and for Journey. <laughs> um, never is enough. So guys, thank you so much for watching and for being here. And stay tuned for seeing my other two silicones to be changed. And um, to do some maintenance or powdering, however you want to call it. And thanks for, for being here and watching until this part. If you have been watching for a while and you're not subscribed please check out all the videos and if you like this channel please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to be notified whenever i upload a new video thanks for watching guys see you later bye, -bye.